It is now 10 years ago that the theory of arterial acceleration was proposed. This theory explains how blood can reach the capillary systems throughout the body despite a massive increase in arterial cross-sectional area that would cause the pressure wave from the heart to dilute greatly along its course over the arterial tree. The theory of arterial acceleration states that the shape of the blood pressure wave contains information about a patient's hemodynamic status. So far, two companies are involved in making the theory of arterial acceleration available to clinicians. Firstly, in its NMA software, Compumetics DWL presents two systolic peaks in TCD recordings of intracranial blood flow velocity. And secondly, Neuromon BV incorporates the theory of arterial acceleration in its simulation software of cardiovascular hemodynamics. Still, despite recording a full waveform, many companies only present systolic, mean and end diastolic blood pressure based upon measuring techniques that are now almost 120 years old and originate from the time of the steam engines. So to all you young doctors out there, modernize and learn how to discriminate two phases in systole. For further details, visit the Neuromon website.